What's going on today, YouTube? I get the question a lot um, when people see some of my dragons that are labeled as translucent. They don't have solid black eyes. They ask if it's translucent if the eyes are not solid black. The answer is yes. Um, if you see, if you look at this one right here, the eyes are solid black on this one, but that is not the um, where the word transparent came from or translucent. It came from the lack of white pigment associated with the gene, which gives the skin the um, transparent appearance. Right here was my first ever um, translucent. He was a hypotrans. He had one solid black eye and the other eye was completely normal. Both uh, dragons with solid black eyes and dragons that have like less than solid black eyes can produce the same types of babies. And that goes both ways. So if you have a, a dragon with two solid black eyes and you breed it, you can breed some. You can make babies that don't have solid black eyes. And again, um, the eyes are not the only indicator of translucent. Um, there's other morphs and sometimes normal dragons that hatch out with black eyes. It's not as often as with translucent, but it happens. Here I have a white hypo. He has black eyes. He doesn't have the translucent gene at all. This guy was named Hollow Man. I named him that way because it seems like he's empty inside because he had the black eyes. He has a white hypo with the um, dark black eyes, so I thought Hollow Man was fitting. But here's an example of a dragon with black eyes that don't have translucent. So when you see black eyes, it isn't always translucent, especially you'll see a lot with zeros. Uh, the first original zeros, they had black eyes as well, but um, the real definite um, marker is the lacking of white pigment which gives the clear appearance um, the transparent appearance on the skin here we have uh, two dunners one is a normal dunner one is a trans dunner if you look at the belly on the one on the left you can definitely see the white the white inside of it and if you look at the one on the right you can see that it's lacking that white which gives us that transparent appearance um, also on the one on the right, it's a translucent, but if you look at the eyes closely, they're not solid black. They are a little darker than normal, but they're not solid black. Okay, here I'm going to show a zero, two different zeros, one translucent zero and one um, normal zero. The normal zero has a black eye as well as the um, translucent has the black eye. But I want you to pay attention to the lip coloration. The one on the left, he happens to be a hypo as well. If it wasn't hypo, it would be a little bit darker, but it will still have the white lips. If you look at the one on the right, it has the translucent, which again, it takes away the white pigment. Look at these lips, they're more pink. Pink is purple. So that's two examples of two dragons that um, do not are not translucent, but have black eyes. And also one example of one translucent that doesn't have solid black eyes. And what, he, actually my first dragon as well that I showed you, he didn't have both solid black eyes, he just had one. Again, you can see the overall color on these two. These are both with blitz. The one on the right is pretty much a normal. The one on the left is a translucent with blitz. But the overall skin tone is different because the, the lack of the white. The translucent stripped away all the white and it gives that pink appearance. But the one on the right, you can see that the white pigment is still in place and it doesn't have that pink 
over tall. So just to be clear, a dragon does not have to have solid black eyes to be a translucent. It does have to have um, less white pigment or the reduction of the white pigment. Sometimes you will see people call stuff partial trans and that is a thing. Um, you'll see like white patches on that, those animals. Um, but I get into that on another video. Thank you guys for watching. Subscribe if you're not already subscribed. We're about 30 away from being 1,000 subscribers. So share the video with your friends and family. Let's get this channel to 1,000. Thanks again. You guys have a good one.